All right. In this step, we want to talk how we can implement an AR simple uh, object uh, whenever we want to detect the ground and after touch on the screen and then uh, show a simple quote and uh, show the received video from the stream and uh, add the chroma key material to it. <coughs> okay. Uh, for here, uh, we need to add uh, uh, the NAR session origin, NAR camera, NAR session, and also uh, we need to work on the simple script. It's called AR click to place. I have made this <laughs> script with this name. Okay, let's to see what is the content of this uh, script. Okay, as at first uh, we need to define entity engine dot XRAR foundation and AR subsystems, and also this is model uh, that things we want to show. Uh, for now, this is the viewer that quote we want to an object to place whenever we touch on the screen and hit the ground detected. Uh, this object will instantiate at there. Then we relocate the model. 3D object to the position of this object to place and placement indicator is that a sign we want to understand where we want to put our object in the 3D space uh, after we detect the, the ground and also the other uh, positions uh, and options for the AR I don't want to talk more about it because I will share this uh, script and you can use it uh, okay, and in here we have a uh, um, public a string chroma key mode. It is exactly like the before. Uh, we find uh, and get the string the chroma key mode in here as well. And once the chroma key mode is true, we don't need to detect the ground and uh, show the indicator and the model. So we will select set active them false placement indicator and also model and also in here the void update uh, we can say once the chroma key mode is equal false we don't need to detect the ground and it will help us to uh, optimize our script and using the CPU and RAM as well uh, once we uh, detect our ground and uh, click it on the on that position we want to show the 3D model, uh, we instantiate an object, object to place, and then relocate the model to the place of the the position of the object to place, and uh, try to set active the indicator and one time equal false. Uh, once the one time equal false is uh, done and uh, our system will not optimize I uh, will not process on the positioning and also touch uh, on the screen and instantiate another object to place you can use this one or you can use uh, uh, another so solutions for that okay and other things for the AR and I don't want to talk about them uh, for that we need to drag and drop in here and also object to place it is an, an prefab an empty object and also in here we have a uh, placement indicator placement indicator is a simple uh, as you can see in here it is a simple quote in here I want to go there with the but it is very fast on my computer Uh, oh, the scale of it is zero. Yeah, for this because we couldn't see it. Yeah, it is that cube and that's good uh, as a placement indicator. Uh, and uh, you can use this texture or whatever you, or whatever you want. And uh, put it as a parameter of a placement indicator. And also for AR cam, you can drag and drop the AR cam. Be sure it is the AR cam and the chroma key mode is from the uh, player prefs. 
and that's it <coughs> excuse me uh, now uh, in the chroma key mode equal false uh, we have this mechanism to instantiate a 2d quad as a video viewer okay what is the content of our video viewer and in here I have made a simple quad and uh, uh, right now as uh, the parent is the, an empty object and put this chroma key a quad with the simple chroma key material uh, transparent and uh, standard and transparent and exactly like the uh, VR mode uh, we can uh, make a render texture in here and drag and drop a render texture from another camera and we can see the content of the uh, in the view of that camera in here and uh, now we want to talk which camera needs to show the content with the chroma key material in here okay as I said before uh, the FMETP try to decode uh, the in list of the bytes and compile it as a video and show it in here as you can see in the FM network manager uh, oh sorry game view decoder we have test image prop this is that things we will show the received video in here in the streaming okay now uh, you need to say uh, this canvas the video streaming canvas the in canvas of UI of the FMETP uh, must be 3d in the word space then in front of this uh, test image raw image you can put a simple camera and it can only show the this screen as you can see the uh, field of view has been set by the size of this screen and also you can say okay uh, and the clear flex must be solid color and this uh, the type of color will be the same and the code of the color will be the same which that uh, color you want to remove by chroma key in here in the chroma key uh, you can say okay this code and color code will be removed by chroma key okay copy and paste and come here in the camera and you say okay the background color will be exactly the same all right now uh, once you uh, uh, your y user a uh, uh, and that uh, wants to uh, stream his uh, view into the server and we receive the video of, of it uh, we will see the result in here then this camera can see only this uh, UI with the green background and we can drag and drop that render texture to this camera so the our viewer chroma key will see the content and view of this camera as you can see this is our render texture and also the chroma key will be show this render texture as a texture I want to show you some example for you to better understanding for example we can drag and drop a quote in here and we say example perfect and we put it in front of this dear camera in here and oh, it must be very huge something like that yeah oh, it's very small okay we can make it very big and all right you can put it here as you can see we can uh, oh in the calling mask we uh, have selected only the UI but we can say see everything so we can see this quote okay and we say okay dear friend please show us 
this texture that's it earth is our home let's keep it safe all right now in the chroma key as you can see it works well this is the result of uh, this chroma key and also this camera uh, can see this view and this quote can show us this view so once you received a video stream from the server and show it on this uh, white raw image this camera can see it and this quote can show us so if you, uh, if we put this viewer, uh, viewer object uh, on that place we want to show in the uh, our AR application as a, an AR um, object so we can see the result of chroma key from the view of the user A into the user B as a AR object now I want to remove our example and everything is fine to have a test perfect everything is fine and we can test it right now and also as you can see we have voice chat also all right uh, uh, we can export an APK right now make sure uh, your scene must be have uh, has register scene and also online stream or uh, whatever you call it for me online stream too and um, it must be has uh, register scene because without it uh, we will have a problem in naming and username and confliction between the uh, received uh, list of the bytes perfect let's go to the next step and test it in the real world